Hey guys, so I'm back with another process video using my kit for this month. So this time I'm going to make another uh, pocket page from my Rome album this time around. And it's just a bunch of food <laughs> because um, I wanted to document this restaurant we went to because we went there like four times um, throughout that uh, our stay in Rome. So it, it went and we loved it. So I wanted to make sure that was documented. So I did pull out those uh, business cards from the uh, restaurant from my memorabilia section to make sure to add them in and I'm just going to go through the two card packs that I have in the kit. The one is the Family Fun um, card pack from Melly Studio. The other one was just a mismatch of cards that I got in the grab bag and then I have some other cards from the Simple Stories and Project Life but I'm not going to use any of those. So I picked out a pink one, that wood grain one I thought looked very nice with the rustic feel of some of this food, kind of. So I'm going to go ahead and use that at the top. At the bottom I'm going to use this pink card. Um, and now I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with the other cards. So I, I do like the red in the center there because I thought I could just list out all the food we ate um, on the one that says things we love. And I did really like the multicolor one over there. So now I just needed two. I didn't know what I wanted to do with the two 4x6 cards. So on the one I decide I'm going to do something with this business card. So I pulled out another uh, simple like journaling kind of card from Ellie Studio. And then I thought about using, I didn't have any other 4x6 cards really. I just had that one that you can see there on the screen that I didn't really want to use on this page. So I decided to just cut a piece of this paper because it does bring in some pink um, and I didn't really have any pink elsewhere at this point. So yes, I do have that photo. I'm not going to end up using that photo. I just felt that was a bit too much because I already have the two ice creams over there. And I already made a layout actually with those ice creams that you'll see probably at the end of the month. So yes, I'm going to go through embellishments. Um, I thought maybe I wanted to make like a big, big cluster of embellishments in the center of this card because I don't have a photo, but I'm not going to end up doing that. Um, I am going to go through everything and see if I want to add something here or there. So I knew I had this other green card, so I thought I might as well check if that works better, but I like this one uh, for this particular page. And then I decided that I don't really want to add anything behind the photos because I, I find that I really like the pictures. And since they are already on like a pattern card, I felt I didn't really need anything in this instance. Uh, so I'm just going to glue down the ones that I'm sure about. So this pink card and the, uh, the wood grain card at the top, which is off camera at the moment, so you can't really see it. And I'm going to go through my little jar of things. So I decided at the top there, I'm going to stick down the business card, and then I'm going to add a couple of other little labels and such. So, yes. I don't know what's happening right now. I didn't edit it this very well, apparently. Okay, so it's probably when I had to stop the video and I came back another day. Um, but yeah. So anyway, we went to Rome in 2016. And we, we were staying in a hotel kind of in the suburbs of the Rome. We weren't in the center. So at night after we went through Rome and came back, we'd found this one place one night, this place I was talking about, right next to our hotel, and it was it was awesome. So we just ended up going there every other night as well. Okay, so now I'm going to work on that card up there. I'm going to add that little happiness found piece. And I'm going to find a couple of other things I want to add and kind of do sort of grid kind of thing. I thought maybe this chipboard, but no. So yeah, this is when I came back another day probably. Okay, so now I'm going to go through the embellishments again. Um, I'm having trouble adding embellishments. I, keep, I tend to keep my pocket pages fairly simple. I don't know why. Um, I mean, pocket pages aren't really my thing. I just kind of do them out of necessity for, like, tra travel albums or for document and event uh, for which I want to scrapbook a gazillion pictures. Uh, 
but yes I do like the look of them I just don't and I don't particularly enjoy the process of making them um, I'd rather make layouts and whatever such okay so I'm gonna stick down the business card stick down this label thingy and I'm gonna find a couple of other labels so that label thingy is from the cut apart for the Family Fun Collection by Ali Studio. Then these other labels that I was looking at were the August label stickers. These are some word stickers from Citrus Twist that don't have a name, so I don't know where they came from. I got them in a grab bag. Um, so I'm gonna stick down that reddish kind of uh, label just to bring in a bit of the red that's in that card. And then on my finger there, I have a yellow sticker that says what's cooking. And I thought, why not use it here? I consider, I'm considering adding like a wood veneer, but I'm not really liking it. So I'm just going to glue down the, the, yikes, the sticker. And then I thought I could fill in the space, some uh, spaces with these hearts. So I'm going to add a gray heart up there, fill in that space, and then a green one. That's too much green in that corner, so I'm going to get rid of it. And at this point, I do feel like it's a bit too too cluttered up there but I'm gonna fix it eventually so I thought about adding a label but no and then I move the heart to the to the center of the label I think that looks a lot better but I'm still gonna come back to that and add something later so now I'm gonna do my journaling and I'm using a Stedler pigment liner uh, in the 0 0.1 tip yes I'm just going to write like a couple of different very generic food <laughs> um, that's Italian related or that we ate. So I think I have gelato, pasta, um, seafood, I don't know. I didn't remember, I, I remember the names of all these things but I wasn't in the mood to look them up so I didn't write like the, and because I, I didn't know where I would spell this stuff correctly so I just wrote some generic generic stuff okay so what else now I want to add some sort of title so I'm gonna go through the letters I have in my kit but I'm going to decide to use these Tim Holtz um, letters that were not in my kit and I'm just gonna sp I, I kind of wanted to write Italian cuisine but I only ended up writing Italian because that's what fit up there um, and again I felt these letters worked better with the feel of the page and also I have a ton of them so I don't feel bad like wasting them whereas the LE Studio ones I don't have so many so I'm still kind of hoarding them. So I'm going to make sure that all of my pictures are glued down and that's going to complete the page. Again I kept it very simple but I do like how it looks and I will probably enjoy flipping through it in my album. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time.